Hello, this is JP Reich, and today I'm going to show you that if you're a Gmail user, that you can use the Microsoft Exchange protocol on your iPhone or iPad so you can automatically sync your email, your contacts, and your calendar with your Gmail account. This is also referred to as Google Sync or Two-Way Sync. Once you set up Google Sync on your iPhone or iPad, it will wirelessly sync with your Gmail account. For example, if you add, change, or delete a contact or calendar event on your iPhone or iPad, it will automatically sync with your Gmail account. One note, if you're a Google Apps for Business user, which means you're a Gmail account holder that does not have an account with gmail.com at the end of it, your administrator must enable this feature for you. On your iPhone or iPad, let's go to Settings, Mail Contacts and Calendars, and click Add Account. We're going to select Microsoft Exchange, and for our email address, we're going to type our Gmail address. Domain is to be left blank. I'm going to type my username, which is my Gmail address. my password and for the account description you can call it anything you want to for this example I'm going to call it Gmail press next when server pops up type m.google.com press next again and when the account's been verified press save Now your Google account will be wirelessly syncing with your iPhone or iPad, and I'm going to show you this now. Once you click on Mail for the first time, it will take a few seconds for Mail to load up. Here I can see that all of my email from my Gmail account is showing up. Next, I can go to my Contacts and see that my Contacts from my Gmail account are showing up here as well. Next, let's check out my calendar. Here I can see that my calendar events are wirelessly syncing with my Gmail account. And to show you that Google Sync is working with my Gmail account, let's look at my Gmail account online. Now that we're looking at my Gmail account, we can see that the email that was on my iPad is also here in my Gmail account. If I delete that email, on my iPad and come back here to my Gmail account, we can see that that email has also been deleted. Now let's check out contacts. The two contacts that were on my iPad are also here on my Gmail account. If we come back here to our iPad and add a contact, Our iPad will wirelessly sync with our Gmail account. Now let's check out our calendar. We can see the calendar event here was also on my iPad earlier. If I remove this from my calendar here on my Gmail account, it will also be removed here from my iPad as well. And now our Google Sync is fully working.